Hello everybody, this is going to be my explanation video, it should be a super quick one, about how it is that I built this slow opening etho door. So if you haven't seen my original video, go back and watch it, I'll leave a link on the screen, and in the description and all that good stuff, so you can see my original challenge video where I showed you this door that I have behind me, and asked you, the viewer, to try and figure out how it is that I built such a device. So, without further ado, I'm going to activate this and show you what's going on. So we hit the lever and come outside here. We're in a redstone testing world. It's kind of unimportant. But if we go down below, there you can, there you go. There's the redstone. Did you guess it? Let me know if you did. As always, I'm going to leave any uh, proper guesses or responses in the description. But I don't think anybody's guessed it as of yet. So anyway, it's pretty, pretty simple. We got a soul sand to slow him down. Iron golem's too wide, so he's going to activate each one of those pressure plates. Water's pushing him. And it's actually actually activating as a one-time use, so you got to come in here and break the blocks and replace them to use it again. So that's a little bit of a trick, and that's why I was able to compact it down. Uh, it's not too compact. There is some pretty crazy redstone going on here. Um, but yeah, that's how it works. So if we come upstairs, you can see that it's going to be slowly opening one layer at a time. And there you go. That's how I did it, guys. Like I said, let me know if you guessed it. Let me know if, uh, if, this, was, if this confused you. I think that's going to do it for me for today, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment, a like, subscribe for more challenge videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Mm,